Crack on him. Yep. Too bad. He's a pretty little bug. Hey there. You're gonna look up for the camera? There you go. Pretty horns. Only six though. Can't shoot you. Yep, I can be nervous. <laughs> it's a small cluster. It's pretty good size too. It's Hello fellow YouTubers, Bear Prepper here. We're out at the retreat garden. Asparagus. Beautiful. Doing great. Very pleased. Spaghetti squash has pretty much had it. I'm going to pick off the last five and pull it up. But we got about five of them on there. There's a nice big one there. That's almost uh, ten inches long. So that's a really nice spaghetti squash. But that'll be the last of the harvest. Strawberries. Spaghetti squash did a number on them. But they're big. Some of them are coming back to life because of the spaghetti squash being gone. So hopefully we'll put some more uh, Medina Plus on them today and that'll help. We've got some carrots coming up. Just a few here and there. Maybe more will come through. I'll probably replant next time. We got a single garlic up. I did do more reading on the garlic, and I think the post that uh, I read at one of the garden centers was probably not appropriate. So I'm going to wait and do these October and just redo them all and then put the elephant and garlic in too. Onions are doing pretty darn good. Some nice looking ones and some still wimpy ones. Stevia. This stuff is sweet. I'm going to pluck off these flower heads because I don't want the plants to die. But they look pretty good. Very healthy. Now it brings me great sadness to look at my tomato plants. They look wonderful. But somebody has helped themselves to the tomatoes. There were at least 50 tomatoes out on these tomato plants. And they would have all been red by now. And they are all gone. All that is left behind are the ones that are green. I am very upset. I can't believe someone stole. But they did. They helped themselves to the entire harvest. So I have absolutely no tomatoes to take home. They're gone. Oh, okay. Maybe I have three little cherries to take home. The rest are gone. Very disappointing. Sweet potato slips. Get a little one peeking up there. Looks like the ones over here didn't make it. But we got some sweet potatoes here. I'm thinking maybe they got trampled. But who knows at this point. I guess there's one good blessing. They didn't rob my pepper plants. And all my peppers are red. Or some shade of red. They didn't get much bigger, which I'm surprised, but they got nice and red. So, yes, I'm definitely going to take these off before I lose them, too. I'm sure some of them were taken, but looks like, for the most part, they were left alone. I just can't believe that my tomatoes are gone. Well, Bobby, it looks like I'm not going to have a... 14 ounce pepper to weigh, but I'll still weigh a couple and see what my poundage is. It looks like the biggest ones were taken. Stevie up here is not doing bad. 
All these flowers need to come off. You can tell the plant is not as healthy. It's not near as green because of the flowers. So we'll cut them off. Now for the tobacco. It's blooming again. And yes, that is about nine feet high. I got a point up for it. And uh, something's been eating it. But we got some nice brown leaves in here. And it looks like it's traveling up the stock, so I think it's probably close to time to pull them off and let these little ones grow. Because I think these little ones will go a lot further. That's about five foot. That one's still only about three foot, maybe four foot. But they, they look showing wear and tear now, so I think it's time for them to come out. So there's the garden. Lots of red peppers. Nothing for tomatoes. The end of the spaghetti squash. Still looks good, but it's just really disappointing. I'll show you the harvest when I'm done. Okay, here's the harvest. I'm giving a few away and used a couple already. This is a one of those big HEB bags. Here's my hand, give you an idea. Corner of the bag, let's see, well, I'm, I'm a little close. There we go, my hand in the corner of the bag. And the bag is pretty deep green peppers and there was one more spaghetti squash gave away and oh, there's more green peppers there whole bag yeah tobacco and I started thinking you know I know all my tomatoes were taken but I'm very thankful they didn't take my green peppers 
I'm very thankful they didn't uh, destroy my plants. They were very gracious with them. And uh, they did turn the electric fence back on. And so the deer didn't get everything. So, you know, you got to count your blessings because they come in all different forms. Blessings.